see the first question the relation r defined on a set of real numbers by r equal to set of all x y such that x minus y plus root 7 is irrational see the relation x related to y the next minus y plus root 7 is irrational check that it is reflexive or not if x related to x then clearly x minus x plus root 7 which is root 7 is irrational that's true so it is reflexive then then we know root 7 is irrational sum of two irrational numbers are irrational sum of a rational and irrational is uh, irrational again and then combinations are okay, no irrational and correct and then lack combination for example root 7 and root 7 it is 7 and the rational and the other is the same and check that it is symmetric see if root 7 related to 1 then root 7 minus 1 plus root 7 which is 2 root 7 minus 1 is there, irrational but 1 related to root 7 which is 1 minus root 7 plus root 7 which is 1 is not irrational so root 7 related to 1 but 1 related to root 7 is not true so it is not similar similarly transitivity see an example 1 related to root 2 that is 1 minus root 2 plus root 7 is irrational and root 2 related to root 7 which is root 2 minus root 7 plus root 7 is root 2 is rational remember 1 related to root 2 is correct root 2 related to root 7 is correct but 1 related to root 7 which is 1 minus root 7 plus root 7 1 is not irrational uh, symmetric index sample so 1 related to root 2 root 2 related to root 7 but 1 not related to root 7 it is not transitive that's a relation next problem so relation r defined on a collection of sets by r equal to set of all a b a and b are sets such that a intersection b is empty that is a intersection b equal to 5 null set See the relation A related to B, then A in section B is empty. That's the relation. Check that it is reflexive. One element related to itself. A related to A. If A related to A, then A in section A is it 5? No, it is not equal to 5. A in section A is A then A. It is not reflexive. Similarly, symmetry. If A related to B, then A intersection B is empty. If A intersection B is empty, B intersection A is also empty. Then clearly B related to A, R is symmetry. And third, consider three sets A, B, C. Suppose A related to B and B related to C. And if A related to B, A intersection B is empty like this. And B related to C, then B in the section C is empty. Maybe C like this, or here B in the section C, here C here, or C here. See, in this case, A in the section C is not equal to 5. A and C have elements in common. So, even A in section C equal to 5 is not true. So, A not related to C. So, it is not transitive. So, it is not a equivalence relation. Next example. A relation R defined on Z. Z is set of integers by R equal to set of AB such that to divides A minus B. That means if A related to B, then 2 divides A minus B. Is it reflexive? If A related to A, 
then 2 divides a minus a, that's a relation. a minus a means 0. 2 divides 0, yes, 2. It is root of Check the symmetry. If a related to b, then 2 divides a minus b by definition. a minus b, a 2 over 2 divided a angle, b minus a over 2 divided a. One is positive and other is negative. So 2 divides b minus a. So b related to a. So it is symmetric. And transitive. If A related to B and B related to C, A related to B means 2 divides A minus B, B related to C means 2 divides B minus Z. A minus B A 2 to divide A, B minus A 2 to divide A. So, or by two, the sum is divisible by 2 or 2 divides A minus B plus B minus Z. That is A minus C. That means A related to C, it is transitive. So it is reflexive, symmetric and transitive. Therefore, it is an equivalence relation. Okay.